What's up world, it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to get rid of the annoying system sounds on your Galaxy S5. Things like the camera shutter sound, or the annoying AT&T jingle that plays every damn time you start your phone, can all be removed with root access. And if you're not rooted, don't worry, there's an easy first timers guide linked out in the article I wrote about this, which you can find by heading to the link in the description below this video. So really all you need for this gadget hack is a root enabled file browser. There's tons of options for you to choose from on the Play Store, so just download the one you like best. Then just navigate to the root partition of your Galaxy and browse through the system folder. From there jump into Media, then Audio, then UI. These are the pesky little buggers right here. Now there's a few different ways you can go about removing these. You can outright delete them, which I wouldn't recommend since you never know if you might want them back. Or you can add a dot back to the end of the file names of the sounds that you want to remove. But that would just take too long. The way I'll be doing it is a simple cut and paste job. That way I'll still have access to them if I want them back, but the system won't be able to play them since it'll be looking in this folder and they won't be there. To find the sounds that have been bugging the crap out of you, just poke around in these files, tap one of them, see what it sounds like, and check the next one, and so on. Then when you find that bothersome sound, long press it and hit cut. If you want to get rid of multiple sounds, just keep selecting all the ones that you don't want to hear anymore. And I've tested this out, so you don't have to worry about messing up your phone if you delete the wrong ones. I removed every single audio file in this folder, and I came out just fine. But once you've made your selections, just hit Cut. Then navigate to your SD card, and create a new folder to put them in. It doesn't matter what you name it, just something that you can remember and get to later, if need be. Next, just paste these files into your new folder. Now they're hidden from Android, so they won't play anymore. Just reboot your phone to clear away any sound files that have already been loaded up. And that's really all there is to it. No more annoying sounds. But yeah, for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article at the link below. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, guys. But until then, hack all the gadgets.